General, a massive cleanup underway in parts of the Northeast where violent thunderstorms overnight damaged homes and trees and knocked out power for hundreds of thousands of customers. High winds flipped over cars in a New Jersey parking lot. And some dramatic video shows a possible tornado or water spout that came dangerously close to the Jersey Shore. Airports were closed from New York City to the Washington, D.C. area for some time while the storms passed through. This is a severe weather in the Northeast, damaging. I mean, it is punishing uh, tornadoes, ripping apart homes, flipping over cars. This is in Deptford, New Jersey. Uh, uh, you can see in this parking lot uh, a possible EF1 tornado causing big problems, flipping over these cars. We had a real mess out there. And then we also started to see torrential downpours. This is in midtown Manhattan. Uh, the rain came down, but we were spared some of the ba bad stuff. This is Hoboken. Look at the lightning. We've got strong storms pushing in over the Midwest. Again, third day in a row we've been seeing this. Omaha, you're looking at showers and thunderstorms moving through right now. For the day from Iowa to Indiana, daytime heating, a lot of moisture coming up from the south right along that boundary layer. And so we have the risk of strong storms, especially this enhanced risk from central Iowa all the way to western Indiana, 20 million people at risk. Tornado threat really greatest in Iowa could be enhanced to a strong risk later this afternoon. And then tomorrow we've got a wide swath 21 million people wind gust of 60 miles per hour hail and tornadoes can't be ruled out flood watches today from des moines all the way to chicago